Dr. John Gorey was not only a medical doctor, but the father of what we know now as modern air conditioning. Hi, I'm Trinity Hardy, and today we'll be taking a tour of the John Gorey State Museum here in Apalachicola. We want to welcome you guys to the John Gorey State Park Museum, uh, home of Dr. John Gorey's Museum here in Apalachicola, Florida. Uh, this man is known as the, the father of refrigeration up in Washington, D.C., where he has his own statue uh, there. Dr. John Gorey, you would have thought, was a man honored here in town initially for becoming the first person to ever make ice and having ways of cooling rooms here, making reenactments of winter. Uh, but sadly for Dr. Gorey, that's not the case. Uh, Dr. John Gorey does, does not find out it's the mosquitoes by any means, but he is here in town. He does make an ice machine in a way of cooling rooms that has helped his patients here significantly, uh, not, not by finding the cause of the disease, but instead by enclosing the rooms. Dr. John Gorey does get a patent for his ice machine here in town. However, as you guys will learn by coming by and seeing us here in the museum, he is not infamously known in the time frame as a, an amazing man or an amazing inventor, uh, but he is instead uh, somebody who's having to convince people the thought of artificial ice isn't that bad. In the museum today, we have, um, we have a, a couple of different displays talking about uh, how he was cooling rooms, how he was, uh, type of uh, instruments he was utilizing to be a doctor, one of the first doctors here in, in Apalachicola in 1833. So some of the uh, ideas and the tools he was using back then are fairly unique to see and neat to see here in the museum. We also have a, a re working replica of his original ice machine. Uh, it does not make ice, but it does get you through the process. It's a three-quarter scale model, uh, but it's neat to come in here and see that thing running and learning how he was making ice and, and how the first machine was here in town. Uh, we have patent drawings that he presented to New Orleans, the patent office, uh, in 1851, prior to us becoming the United States in 1865 after the Civil War. Uh, so he would present that to New Orleans. We have patent drawings to show off as well. When Dr. Gorey passes away, so does his ice machine more or less. He owned the patent to it. He owned the right to it. And people didn't like the idea of ice anyways in this time period. So we're hoping to interpret that going forward. All the different ACs. I mean, because his way of cooling rooms was, some would say, 10 to 14 degrees. Fun fact, the John Gorey State Museum is located in Gorey Square, one of the six original squares in the city of Apalachicola. For a complete tour, you can visit the John Gorey State Museum at 46 6th Street in the city of Apalachicola. For a complete list of Franklin County Museums, visit floridasforgottencoast.com and we'll see you next time on another museum tour.